as disciples of Jesus Christ, we cannot lead anyone. We can't be the Holy Spirit for anyone. But we can share our testimony. We can encourage others. And we can teach others to go to Jesus and to be led by the good teacher. The issue is, a lot of people are trying to be led by the Holy Spirit by other brothers and sisters' words. And they get on the internet and they get all confused because they just can't make, they just can't make sense of what brothers and sisters are saying. You cannot follow Jesus by following the Bible or following another brother or sister's words. The only way to follow Jesus and to be in the truth is to be connected to the vine. Jesus is the vine. We are the branches. He gives us his spirit of truth to lead us and to guide us into all truth and to remind us what he's already taught us and to tell us things to come. Another brother or sister is not worthy to lead you. You need to stop taking advice from other brothers and sisters. You need to stop just perusing the internet, listening to emails. You'll quickly deceive yourself by listening to others. That's why it's so important that you're really hearing from Jesus Christ and truly led by his spirit. Satan will not confuse a true brother or sister in the Lord using a wolf in sheep's clothing. That would be too easy. He uses other brothers and sisters to distract brothers and sisters. It's very important that we follow Jesus Christ, not another brother or sister. Are we really led by the Holy Spirit? Do we hear his voice? Are we spending time in our prayer closet? Are we staying on our knees? Are we keeping our prayer life alive? Or are we just listening to other brothers and sisters and people's opinions on the internet?